Poop pads, also known as puppy pads or pee pads, can be used to assist. Your puppy learn the proper places to relieve himself. You'll have to teach your puppy to use a pee pad because it's not an instinctive behavior. Using this method, you may then utilize it to teach your puppy to eventually go outdoors and relieve itself. In the beginning, potty training can be tough for new puppy owners, but there are a number of tools you can use to help your puppy go to the bathroom in the right place. Picking out a potty pad. The purpose of utilizing a potty pad is to offer your puppy with a visible and predictable location to relieve himself. You'll want something that can handle the messes that your puppy will generate, is easy to clean, and is large enough to accommodate those messes. Large breed dogs may necessitate heavier duty gear than smaller dogs. Store-bought pee pads or indoor, outdoor carpet body stations can be used instead of newspapers, paper towels, cloth towels, or paper towels. It can be difficult to clean up after your dog defecates on newspaper or paper towels. But they are inexpensive. Because they can be chewed like a blanket or toy, cloth towels are less absorbent yet require more frequent washing. Most people prefer to use store-bought pee pads as they are more absorbent and can be easily thrown away after use. For little dogs, indoor-outdoor carpet potty stations specifically intended for dogs are an excellent option. Learn about the potty pads with your puppy. Do not hide the potty pads from your puppy. When it comes to potty time, it will be able to handle the new item without being afraid of it. Repetition of a command, such as, go potty, can help your puppy learn to go to the bathroom on command. How to know. When to expect your puppy to go potty. Keep your puppy close by so that you can anticipate when they will need to relieve themselves. In order to know when and how often your puppy will have to go potty, keep a close eye out for the following signs and behaviors. After snoozing, eating, and drinking, puppies often go to the bathroom. Following one of these behaviors, you should pick up your puppy and place it on the potty pad around 15 minutes later in expectation of it having to urinate or defecate. Instead of playing or chewing on a toy, if your puppy starts sniffing around on the ground, it probably needs to go potty. If it does this, you'll need to pick it up and set it on the potty pad. Every two to three hours, your dog may need to relieve itself. Make it a point to take your dog to the bathroom on a regular basis. Your dog deserves a reward. Puppies respond well to positive reinforcement, such as a pat on the head and a treat. As soon as your dog uses the pee pad, make sure to give it lots of praise. This can be done in a variety of ways, including verbally exclaiming your excitement, caressing your puppy, or giving it a soft treat that you save just for bathroom time. Consistency is key. Ensure that your puppy has a consistent routine. To help you anticipate when your puppy may need to go to the bathroom, this will help you. Each time you provide a command, use the same sentence. You should keep the potty pad in the same spot until your puppy learns to use it on his own. Your puppy's ability to use the potty pad can then be gradually moved closer to where you want him to finally go to the bathroom without the usage of a potty pad. Mistakes to avoid in your training. Make sure that you don't encourage your puppy to play or chew on the potty pad. Your puppy may be perplexed as to the purpose of the potty pad as a result. Do not change the potty pad around until your puppy has learned what it is for and constantly relies on it for bowel movements. Make sure you use a treat that your dog is truly looking forward to receiving. This will aid in the training of the new employee. Behavior issues and proofing. Make sure your puppy gets to the pee pad on time by placing it near where it plays or eats, then gradually move it closer to the door to educate it to use the bathroom outdoors. If your puppy is having accidents when you aren't looking because you can't keep an eye on it, consider the following methods. Add a bell on its collar so that you can hear where it is at all times. A trail of some sort will be left for you by leaving the dog's leash attached. Dogs don't like to mess where they sleep, so consider putting your puppy in a crate or exercise pen while it's napping. Talk to your veterinarian if your puppy is urinating all the time. And you don't know what the problem could be.